Мне на самом деле очень нравился английский язык. Я даже участвовал в нескольких олимпиадах, помню, по английскому языку. Hello everyone, it's time for English lesson. My name is Natalia Ljashko. Let's start. I would like to welcome my very dear guest today. Hello, Max. <laughs> Hello, Natalia. How are you today? I'm good, thanks. How are you? I'm fantastic. Are you ready for the lesson? <laughs> I'm ready. Let's yeah, start. Looking forward to it. So, we continue talking about sports. And I would like to ask you, do you like sports? Uh, I enjoy sports a lot. Uh, I've been playing football uh, almost professionally, but it was my one of my biggest dreams to become fantastic. a football player. Fantastic. <laughs> Fantastic, <laughs> yeah. thank you. Our last lesson was on football. Unfortunately, we didn't have you as a guest. So that yeah. would be a great pleasure, right? So yeah. let's start. Have a look at the picture and you guys try to find as many sports as you can. All right. So, Max, what can you see? Uh, I see football, I see mm -hmm. boxing, I okay. see... Uh, uh how to say it? it's not a wrestling it's uh this one uh, no it's a boxing i guess okay uh, it's powerlifting powerlifting yeah. okay yeah. what about uh, this one it's uh, swimming i mm -hmm. think it's artistic swimming right? yes yeah then uh, well done what about this one have a look uh, was that figure skating what is that uh the guy is on the board and it's kind of a wave here i have no clue what's that this but, is windsurfing. Oh, windsurfing, yeah. Yes, okay. <laughs> it's, Good. It's, uh, um, what about this one? Have a look at this playground. Uh, it's uh, artistic gymnastics. Well done. That's my sister been in the uh, team of Ukraine. Wow, yeah, fantastic. Yeah. Anything else? Uh, then I see uh, some uh, handball. Okay. Tennis. Okay. Uh, basketball. Fantastic. Uh, well wrestling. Done. Mm -hmm. uh, running. Okay. And uh, what else? Uh, volleyball. Yes. Let's and have a look at this one. What's this? Uh, polo. Uh, horse riding. Horse okay, riding, at I least. Guess, yeah. And what about this one? It's uh, table tennis. Table tennis. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> have you ever tried? Uh, have yeah, you ever played? I, I like it a lot. Yeah. Yes. It's very nice. Okay, so we continue talking about sports, and uh, I would like to ask you about fishing. Do you consider fishing <laughs> as a sport? Uh, I don't think it's a sport. Uh, I think it's just, uh, for some people, it's uh, enjoyable time wasting. Mm -hmm. I see. <laughs> well, we're going to fish now, okay? So All this right. is going to be a game. Okay. Do you like games? Uh, I'm, I'm okay to waste my time like this. <laughs> <laughs> to waste your time? Probably enjoy your time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so let's play with but I us. Said, but I said enjoyable time wasting. Ah, oh, enjoyable yeah. time wasting. Okay. So imagine that we can't have a real fishing rod here. Yeah. Imagine this is my fishing rod. See? Yeah. This is a sticky hand. Mm -hmm. And these are your fish that you mm -hmm. need to catch. So you're going fishing like this. You need to catch <laughs> a fish, okay? All so, right. I'm giving you a new one. This is mine. Okay, okay. And this is yours. <laughs> so, okay. I'm going to catch from here? Yep. All right. This is going to be real <laughs> fishing for you. <laughs> so, let's try. So, you need to catch at least one fish. Let's try. <laughs> you can try at home. Just take a slime, for example, <laughs> and try to catch a paper that you place near you. All right. Yes, try to catch it. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> yeah, fantastic. <laughs> Amazing. That was the word. Uh, yes, yeah, so it's uh, snorkeling. Snorkeling. Can you explain to us what does it mean snorkeling? Uh, yeah, it's when you uh, just dive with some mask on, with uh, usually with oxygen. Okay. And uh, nitrogen as well. Okay. And uh, you swim and enjoy the sightseeing uh, underneath the water. Okay. Yeah. So, 
you guys described snorkeling as well. What does it mean to you? Do you remember? You wear a wetsuit, flippers, goggles, and a snorkel, right? That's why it's called snorkeling. Okay, let's try one more time. <laughs> let's try. This is very funny. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Good! <laughs> Okay. All right. English is fun, yeah. right? This is yoga. Yoga. How yeah. can you describe yoga? Well, yoga is... Uh, I tried once. Okay. And, uh, you know, I thought it's very easy, but uh, I underestimated that kind of uh, sports, I would uh -huh. say. Because uh, usually, you know, you see women usually doing that. Yes. And you think, well, it's easy. You know, if girls can do it, I can do it too. Okay. But when I tried... <laughs> it's not that yeah, easy, it right? It was a pain, yeah. yeah. So, a lot uh, of stretching. A lot of stretching, yeah. And uh, I think uh, it's difficult to do. So mm -hmm. uh, I think it's a very good exercise. And mm -hmm. uh, for some people, it, uh, they combine it with meditation. Yes, as well. And uh, it's a very good dis self discipline, uh, uh, especially when people do it in the morning, like when, exactly. when it's a sunrise and uh, five in the morning mm -hmm. and on a nice beach or something. I've, I've been doing it once like that and I enjoyed it a lot. It was yes, good. I agree. And yoga actually is considered as the healthiest sport, let's say like this, because you can't damage yourself, you do exactly what you can. Okay? Yeah. So let's try the third one, the third attempt. <laughs> All right. So three is a good number, right? <laughs> yeah. Let's go. Okay, sorry. One more time. Okay, bravo, bravo, well done. So what do you have there? <laughs> All right, so it's ice hockey. Oh, ice hockey. Yeah. Let's talk about the equipment. What do we need for ice hockey? Uh, we need skates. Skates, okay. Uh, we need uh, all that equipment. Uh, I mean, hockey. To protect yourself, yeah, yeah, yeah the yeah. helmet. Uh, helmet. Uh, stick. Stick, I guess, yeah. Yes, and what we and do we call a black thing that is you not know, a ball? I don't know how it's called in English, I guess. But I'm sure that our students know. Yeah. So what do we need for <laughs> ice hockey? A stick and a puck, exactly. A it's puck? called a puck. 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 Right. Yes, okay. a puck. Okay, thank you very much. You can put your fishing All rod right. aside. You will enjoy fishing later. Right. So I have prepared some more equipment for you. All right. So let me do some magic here. <laughs> So, as you see, I have a lot of equipment, right? Yeah. Do you know all these things? I think so, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, let's start with the biggest part. What's this? Have a look. It's a helmet for uh, martial arts. Yes, kind of. What kind of martial arts do you remember? Uh, like any kind of martial arts. Like, uh, it could be a boxing, mm -hmm. it could be a Muay Thai, Thai boxing, kickboxing. Okay. Uh, it could be uh, just for Taekwondo. Exactly. Uh, all this kind of stuff. So you name all the words with we have, uh, that we have already studied with our students. I'm very familiar with this. Uh, I used to do Thai boxing for... Fantastic. Well, so let, me, let, uh, let us choose. Boxing or kickboxing? Uh, kickboxing. Kickboxing. Let me yeah. write it down. Kickboxing. Well done. What's this? Yeah. Uh, that's uh, for uh, skiing, uh, mm -hmm. so just uh, how not only it? for Protective skiing. Area. When you do like this, it's not skiing. What's this? Uh, if you do like this, snowboarding. Yes, snowboarding. exactly, snowboarding. Glasses, yeah. So we can call it a mask or glasses. I guess. Uh, what kind of this? This uh, is the same word. Uh, glasses. No. Yeah. No. Uh, students know goggles. Oh, goggles. Goggles. Right. Yes. Can yeah. you repeat, please? Goggles. Goggles. One yeah, more time. Goggles. Yes. <laughs> okay. So these are goggles for swimming or uh -huh. snorkeling, and these we can call it a mask or goggles as well for snowboarding. All right? right. Yeah. Let's go with the word. <clears throat> can you read again, please? Goggles. Fantastic. Remember, this is not Googles. <laughs> okay. This is a mask as well, but this is a kid's one, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, if we take, uh, if we have a look at this one and this one, which is professional, what do you think? Uh, which one is professional? Yes. Oh, I guess on the right side. Yes, yeah. exactly. So, yeah. what's this? 
Uh, that uh, could be a snorkeling mask. Right? <laughs> Trumpet, <laughs> oh, no? sorry, snorkeling tube. Yes, this is a yeah. snorkel. Yeah, yeah, a way. snorkel. Okay, let's write down the word. Snorkel. Okay. Yeah. Uh, what else do we have here? We have a ball. What kind of ball is this? <laughs> it's a football ball. Football ball. The Americans call it soccer. <laughs> yes. Do you like but football? But that's wrong. Huh? Uh, of course, uh, I love it. I love yes, it. you mentioned yeah. from the very beginning that yeah. you love football. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to write football. This is interesting. So the name of the equipment is football and the name of the sport is football as well. So easy to remember. Football for football. Okay? Tell it, Amer uh, say it to Americans. Uh, so <laughs> this is a football for soccer, yeah, 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 <laughs> right? Yeah. Like this, different. Because they have hand egg, right? Yeah, but they call hand it egg. football. What's this? Uh, this is a uh, jump rope. Jump rope or skipping yeah. rope? Skipping yeah. rope, okay. Yeah. So let me write a uh, rope, just a rope. Yeah. Let's go with this word. And do you remember what do we need for ice hockey? Uh, yes, yeah, skates. Skates and? Uh, pack. A stick? A stick and a pack, yeah. A puck. Yeah, a puck. Puck, puck right. yes. Uh, P-A-C-K? P-U-C-K. Oh, P-U-C-K, okay. A stick and a puck. Okay. Puck, okay? Stick. So, now let's write a dictation, guys, together with us. So, we are going to use these words you remember from the previous lesson. So, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven words. I'm going to count from one to five. While I'm counting, you choose one word and write it down. Only one word, please. And when I say five, we are going to say our words and you check with us. So I'm writing, Max is writing, and you are writing. We're going to have three words. And actually, your task is to guess a my word. Ваша задача відгадати моє слово. Поки я рахую від одного до п'яти, ви записуєте лише одне, будь-яке з цих слів. І коли я кажу п'ять, ми перевіряємо. So, if you guess my word, you're going to score one point. This is easy, okay? So, Max, mm -hmm. let's um, <coughs> go. We have seven words. You need to choose one, okay? Mm -hmm. And when I say five, you're going to tell me the, your word. I'm going to write as well, okay? I can choose any word. From the board. All right. Okay? Yeah. So, let's read the words to remember. Uh, kickboxing, goggles, snorkel, football, rope, stick. Park. Park, easy. Okay, so let's go. I'm counting. You choose one word and write it down. Right. Let's go. Write it down. Don't forget. One, two, three, four, five. So what's your word? Guess. Ah, you tell me. <laughs> Football. Football. Yeah. My word is park. <laughs> Sorry, no match with you. But if you guess the word, there is one point to you. Let's try again? Yeah. Okay, let's go. So, one, two, three, four, five. What's your word? Puck. My word is snorkel. <laughs> Sorry, no match again. But if you guess the word, there are two points for you. Yeah. So, let's try it last time. Okay, okay, okay. One, two, three, four, five. Goggles. <gasps> Fantastic! I've got goggles as well! Bravo! So three points go to you. Yeah. If you wrote goggles, then you, have, uh, you also have three points. So if you had one point here, two points here, and goggles three points, how many points altogether? Bravo, six. <laughs> Unf unfortunately, Max, you have only three. Yeah. Sorry, <laughs> life is not fair. But I one shot, three points. It's yes, good, good. this is a really nice shot. Yeah. <laughs> Fantastic. So let's move on. I want you to write um, a text with us. All but right. text has got some gaps. Okay? Mm, yeah. So we're going to fill in the gaps. And mm. these are actually the words that we need for the text. All right. You can't see the text, so we'll be guessing. Mm -hmm. So guys, you're going to write with us. Please write down... Uh, ten numbers from one to ten in a column and follow us with all the words that we need. I'm going to write my words on the board for you. So let's go. Number one is an adjective. So can you come up with an adjective? Any adjectives? Uh, beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, yeah. so you write down your words. I'm going right. to write my words. So if you say beautiful, I'm going to go with the word clever. 
you're beautiful and clever. Okay. No, Number really two. Please. Number from 10 to 20. Uh, let's do it 17. 17, write okay. down. You 17, I'm going to choose 13. Okay. All right. Number three, any number. Seven. Seven. <laughs> I'm going to go with number one. Job? Uh, pilot. Okay, can you come up with something more interesting? You Me? are a pilot. <laughs> <laughs> you are a pilot. Let's go something better. I already you're not wrote do it down. <laughs> Sorry, cross uh, it out. Well, uh, uh, it's going to be a lawyer. Lawyer, yeah. fantastic. So you are a lawyer. I'm going to be, uh, well, I'm a teacher, but let me be a gymnast. Okay. All right. But gymnast is not a, uh, I don't, I don't hey, think if it's I'm a, a professional gymnast, <laughs> let it be my job, okay? Yeah, right. So number five, one more adjective. Uh, well, it's going to be honest. Interesting. <laughs> I'm going to choose interesting. Uh, you write down honest. So what does it mean, honest? Chastney, yeah. right? Uh, yeah. Spravedlivy. Let's go on. Number six, sports. Can I guess your word? Football. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, football it is. Okay, write yeah. down football. I'm going to write um, snowboarding. All right. Snowboarding. <clears throat> What's next? A year. Mm hmm Any? I would say 2014. Okay, write it down. I'm going to go with 2005, okay? A think, anything, anything, like a pen, a snorkel, a mask, a, a crown, a book, a, mm, anything. A, a car. Table. A car, okay, write down a car. I'm going to go with a um, pencil. All right. Okay. Piece of clothing. Shoes. Shoes, okay. Um, I'll go with a wet suit. And the last one is food. Fish. Okay. For me, pizza. <laughs> All right. Looks like a nice lunch. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, ready to read the text? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, guys, get your 10 words ready. We are starting the text. So, I would like you to read the text and instead, it's, instead of your gaps, you're going to read your words. So, <laughs> let's start. All right. Uh, hello, my name is Max. My name is Max. What's your uh, family name? Uh, Max Beautiful. Uh, I'm Natalia Kleva. Oh, so that's my last... <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, let's start again. <laughs> I cannot say that. <laughs> Why? No. You, but this is your word. This yeah, is a silly text. No worry. But I'll skip that one. All right. I don't okay. want to call myself beautiful. Let's so. change the words. You're gonna be clever. I'm gonna be beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's so let's change it. <laughs> so you choose clever. I'm gonna say beautiful. <laughs> okay. Well, actually, <laughs> men usually say handsome, not beautiful, yeah. right? But so I'm for you, be... beautiful is good. It's okay. Yes. yes. You're going to be clever. Let's go yes, again. Yes, I am. All right. So, uh, my name is Max uh, Clever. Okay. <laughs> I am uh, 17 years old. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm famous. I'm a famous pilot. Well done. <laughs> I've been flying for seven years, but before that, I was a professional lawyer. <laughs> <laughs> That's nice. Okay. Yeah, this was interesting. <clears throat> okay. Uh, ah, you've got honest here. Yeah. <laughs> Don't cheat. Okay, interesting is my word. Oh, okay. I thought we switched it. All right. Okay. I love sports and I'm good at it. Football. Fantastic. Uh, I do it every day since uh, 2014. Okay. <laughs> Uh, talking about professional equipment for my sport activities, I always wear a car. A car. <laughs> In the pocket, probably. Yeah. Okay. And shoes. Fantastic. Yeah. Not trainers. Th that's so... kind of much, right? <laughs> <laughs> so with a car and shoes, not yeah. trainers. This is interesting. Yeah. This is Max yeah. style. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And after I finish my sport lesson, I usually eat fish. This is nice. Yeah. So. Uh, do sports, eat healthy food, and study English because this is 
Clever. Oh, clever, yeah, number one. Number yeah. one. Okay, so yeah. let me read my text. It's going to be different. So my name is Natalia Beautiful. I am 13 years old. I'm a famous teacher. Uh, I've been teaching for one year. Oops. <laughs> Actually, more. But before that, I was a professional gymnast. Oh, I'm so proud. So this was um, interesting. I'm going to use the same word. <laughs> I love sports and I'm good at snowboarding. Um, I do it every day since 2005. Talking about professional equipment for my sports activities, I always wear a pencil. Why not? While snowboarding is very important. And wetsuit. Hmm. This is not going to work. <laughs> and Good after... combination. Yes, yes. <laughs> for snowboarding. After I finish my sport lesson, I usually eat pizza. Oops, this is not healthy. Do sports, eat healthy food and study English because this is ah, beautiful. I'm going to say amazing. So let's correct the text. Let's write down the real text. Uh, so Max, please yeah. correct the information, real information about you. All right. Uh, my name is Max Mihailuk. Uh, I'm 34 years old. I'm a famous, uh, I'm just a pilot now. <laughs> okay. Uh, I've been flying for uh, nine years by now. Good. Uh, but before that, I was a professional. Uh, I did a lot of stuff. Footballer? Uh, I wish. But anyway, yeah. Okay. My, my dream was to be a professional footballer. Uh, this was... Uh, Adjective. Uh, Interesting, fantastic. Oh, yeah, this was a uh, very good experience. It was amazing. Good. <clears throat> I love sports and I'm good at, uh, I can say, football. Uh, I do it every day since uh, I was eight years old. Fantastic. Uh, yeah, actually before, but I played in the team since I mm -hmm. was eight. Uh, talking about professional equipment for my sports activities, I always wear, uh, if we're talking football, uh, nice cleats. Okay. And, uh, and Trainers? Uh, my, my favorite uh, shorts. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. Uh, after I finish my sport lesson, I usually eat uh, some carbohydrates and mm -hmm. protein. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is nice. Do you eat a snack bar, healthy snack bar? Uh, not really. I'm just uh, trying to eat uh, regular food, which is uh, pretty mm -hmm. much clean. Okay. Yeah. Can a banana work? <laughs> yeah, of course. Yes, yeah, a yeah. banana can work after sports. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. so finish the sentence. Uh, do sports, eat healthy food and study English because this is uh, very, very useful. <laughs> mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Best, Best Max. Best Max. <laughs> okay, this is going to be your homework to write a real text about you. But before that, let's focus on pre uh, prepositions. Have a look. We have for, before, at, since and after. Let's take before and after. What's the difference between these two things? Max, can you help me? Before and after, when do we use these things? Well, it's pretty clear. Before we use... Uh for something that happened before some moment mm -hmm. uh, and uh, after we use as the aftermath. Okay. Talking about something that already happened. Let me help you. So we have a time climb and let's have, we have an action there. Yes, for example, yeah. football match or uh, training or your lunch, anything, any action. So before that time, peretsim. Peretsim, before that time, before a football match, before I join the team, before I go to school, peretsim. And after this, this is something that you do when you finish doing this action. Pisla, peret i pisla, before and after. Okay, what's the difference between for and since? How can you uh, explain this? Uh, <clears throat> for and since? Mm-hmm. Uh, but they're pretty much... Uh, oh, okay, if you're talking about time, right? Mm -hmm. Have yeah. a look. I've been flying for, yeah, yeah. for right. example, so. five years, and I, I do football every yeah, yeah. day since... So in this case, we're talking about particular uh, amount of years. Okay, so, uh, period, uh, right? Yeah. Uh, period or just uh, a number of... Uh, yeah, 
mm-hmm. period of years, I guess. Okay. Yeah. So period of time in years. Mm-hmm. And uh, since is the point where we start. So pretty much exactly. uh, since some kind of age. In my case, it was eight years old. When I was eight years old, I started to play football in a mm-hmm. team. Okay. But, but if we're talking about since, I've been playing football since I remember myself. Yes, so, oh, since uh, yeah. I was eight. So again, yeah. let's take a time climb, okay? So we have a point, exact point, as you have mentioned, a yeah. starting point. Yes. So starting points, we say since. Yeah. Since that time, since uh, 2005, yeah. uh, since Monday, for example, since winter, okay? Or since yeah. I was eight. And when we have the beginning of the period and end of the period, so we have a closed period. We have started and we have finished. So we say for. So this can be for five days, for five years, for five months, for example, anything. The beginning and the end. This is for. Okay. And uh, the phrase I'm good at. So you can't say I'm good in football, right? Yeah. This is just a phrase that you need to remember. <clears throat> I'm good at. What else are you good at? Uh, <laughs> what else I'm good at? Uh, it's sixth grade, right? Seventh. <laughs> I'm joking. It's okay. Yeah, but anyway, uh, I think I'm good at uh, all of my hobbies because mm-hmm. I enjoy them a lot. Mm-hmm. Uh, everything that has to do with sports and I okay. think uh, learning languages. That's uh, nice. I really like learning Spanish as well. Good. And, uh, because I used to have a lot of students from mm-hmm. uh, South America. And, oh, uh, that's great. I've been enjoying talking to them and uh, at that period of my life I started to speak kind of Spanish, but not speak, I, I would say started to learn. From Spanish, uh, I remember Spanish. only si and no. That's <laughs> yeah. it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah. so mm-hmm. now it's time for a little quiz. Let's go. The first question to you, what's the difference between for and since? Do you remember? Okay, so have a look again. Since, the starting point, and for, the close period. What's the difference between before and after? Okay, Max, again, can you translate these words for the students? Yeah, so before... It's a uh, period mm-hmm. Do. and mm-hmm. uh, versus after, after is postle. Yeah, so when we fin- before we finish and after we finish. Well done. So your home task is going to be to write a paragraph about you and your favorite sport using prepositions for, since, before and after. And I hear the bell ringing. It means that we need to stop the lesson. Thank you very much, Max. Thank you very much. Thanks Did you enjoy the lesson? I enjoyed it a lot. Thanks a lot for having me here. Thanks yes. So. so, have a great day Thank and you. see you next time, guys. Bye bye. Конечно, было очень весело, информативно, и я думаю, что ученикам, онлайн ученикам было очень интересно.